Hi, it's Joe sitting with Kelly in beautiful Kiev in the spring. And um, you just recently met an amazing gal through, uh, through Tatiana that hooked you up. And maybe it's love, huh? Huh? Yes, uh, I hope so. And uh, I think it'll take about six months or a year to know for sure. But uh, I'm going to give it a try. And I, I appreciate what Joe and Tatiana have done. Can you share your story with us, Kelly? Uh, your journey, you know, you dated lots of ladies before you played a little bit in fantasy land uh, with some of the uh, big known scam sites hello my name is Kelly from uh, down south in the states first of all let me tell you if you come to Kiev uh, I guess Ukraine in general or in general you're gonna love the ladies in Kiev I've just been in Kiev for the last uh, five weeks because I don't know, must be something in the water. They're all born beautiful, it seems like. Uh, I found a match guarantee when I was, actually I was looking for uh, scammers and found all the different websites on the internet. And uh, I could tell right off they went about the process different than anyone else. And so I've talked with Joe and he got me in touch with Tatanya and this is completely different in that they want to talk to you. I never could talk to anybody else in any of those, uh, uh, by, say, big-time dating websites. Nobody would talk to me. Uh, and I had several conversations with Joe uh, over the phone, and I would use Skype, and he called me, and we texted, and we uh, emailed back and forth. Uh, and then we set up an appointment for me to meet with Titania when I got here. She had actually uh, given me some names of ladies she wanted me to meet. And I say taking her advice is the best thing you can do because uh, at least the lady that I wound up with, I had no interest at all just by looking at her photo. But somehow or another, Titania has this sixth sense that she can tell kind of who gets along and uh, want to tell you about my journey uh, on this trip to find a, a good woman <laughs> and actually started maybe uh, 12 or 15 years ago and at then I was definitely in the fantasy world because uh, I was looking in anesthesia and looking for these girls that were 25 to 35 all gorgeous of course but uh, whenever we chatted uh, I never could get any answers from anything any specific answers about anything and so I just quit for a while and then uh, about six or eight months ago uh, I got on with Charm Date and uh, from my experience with Charm Date I had realized that anybody 25 to 35 is not going to have anything to do with a old codger like me so I got in the reality more and uh, searched for ladies from 55 to 65 and uh, had a few that returned uh, uh, information to me emails to me and uh, so I came to Kev and met with Titania and uh, started uh, going on some dates with these ladies and uh, you can really tell the difference between the fantasy and the reality when you actually meet these ladies that are associated with with a match guarantee because you know that you've got somebody here that's uh, working for you, specifically Titania, who interviews the ladies and she can tell, she has a sixth sense about uh, who would be right for each other. Uh, in the true sense, she's a matchmaker. And so I would highly suggest uh, the Match Guarantee. From the uh, ladies that I received from Match Guarantee, I had chosen about 10 ladies. And uh, Tatiana had suggested some other ladies. Well, I had, when I got here, uh, I went on some dates with some of the ladies I had chosen. But actually it wound up that the uh, one of the ladies that Titania had suggested is the one that worked out right with me because when I met her, I knew she was the right lady for me to be with. And so uh, 
I just highly recommend the services of Match Guarantee because their purpose seems to be to match people and uh, not just go with this fantasy world of where uh, they're just trying to get you to write letters and uh, uh, chat back and forth for, I don't know, months or years with someone because uh, that's not going to work out. Kelly. At Match Guarantee, of course, we're all about playing in reality, not fantasy. And, of course, that's part of our job is to help get guys from the fantasy land that the industry wants them to play in, in into reality, where they can be successful, meet a real woman, have a real relationship. And these women are amazing, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, so if you could help us with that task and just maybe share some tips and advice that you would have so that the Western men can be successful coming to Ukraine. Okay. The the first tip I have that if it uh, if it looks like this po can't possibly be true, it's probably not true. And uh, so, uh, for many years, that's what I had been doing when I was uh, using other dating sites. And so, I suggest that you know you get into reality and uh, check uh, Joe and Titania at Match Guarantee. I experienced uh, Anastasia and Charm Date before I met uh, some real people that would help me. And uh, here at uh, Match Guarantee, uh, they have helped me help me meet uh, hopefully the love of my life. And uh, like I said, give me a six months or a year, and we'll know for sure. Well, uh, I started with uh, Anastasia many years ago and uh, then about six months ago I guess at the first of November last year I found a charm date and uh, this looked pretty good to me and I spent you know four thousand dollars I guess overall talking with some of the women well really just writing letters uh, to their to their picture that was online and uh, kind of got a bad feeling about some of it because uh, whenever I tried to ask any specific questions, I never got a specific answer. But out of 16 ladies that I contacted, uh, I finally decided there were maybe five from uh, Kev and from Odessa that would actually have been interested in meeting me. Uh, and somewhere in the meantime there, I found a match guarantee here. And so I thought I'd give them a try. And uh, they go about it totally different. Uh, so uh, with match, uh, I really didn't have any, well, I had 10 ladies to meet and uh, I had selected, because I'm 70, I'd selected ones from 55 to 65, and I thought that would be appropriate because I'll tell you folks, uh, that fantasy you're looking at for those 25-year-olds, they ain't interested in those 70-year-olds, and they're probably not interested in any 50-year-olds, no matter what they tell you. So uh, I'd searched on the match guarantee website for uh, ages 55 to 65 and there was about oh, 15 or 20 and I selected uh, 10 of the ladies that kind of caught my eye and uh, then they said well you go ahead and select some more and uh, so I lowered the age down 50 to uh, 65 and Titania she's uh she's the one that interviews the ladies suggested that uh she's had some ladies that she suggested that i meet well i didn't know about this too much but i tried anyway and there's one lady on there that uh from her photos uh like i told joe she came across as a as a dour middle-aged school marm that uh didn't really want to give you the time of day from looking at the pictures. 
And when they set up the date for me to go with her, I thought, well, give me about 15 minutes just to be nice. And uh, I, can get, I can get away from her and go do something fun. And uh, it didn't take 15 minutes for me to decide that this is the lady I wanted. Uh, the, uh, she was immediately interested in me. And uh, really, that's more important than the good looks and I guess a benefit is she's still a good looking lady. Uh, I met her on her 52nd birthday and uh, I'm 70 so you can tell the age difference. But uh, she was completely interested in me. And uh, one of the best ways you can tell is after I'd been here in Kev for about a month, I developed an allergy. Don't have any allergies that I knew of, but I developed an allergy and started the uh, symptoms of a cold, of having a stuffy nose and cough and the things you get when you have an allergy. And uh, she immediately started taking care of me. Uh, better than a wife, just about. She was like a nurse. And she would walk to the pharmacy and walk to the places. We finally decided that the reason that I was getting sick is because I, I use a BiPAP machine, so it has water in it that it expels over the night to, to help the air that you breathe be moist. And I was using bottled water, the same that you drink, and I suggest don't do that. It says use distilled water, and I thought I could get by with the bottled water. So she walked to two different service stations to get me distilled water, and uh, we didn't even know this was going to work, but it did. So uh, I'm a believer in the match guarantee because I'll tell you what happened with the uh, charm date. Okay, so I had a chance to go on a date with a lady from the charm date. And uh, we had a translator, of course. And after the first date, I didn't uh, feel very good about it, but I thought I'd give it one more chance. She's 50, and of course I'm 70, so there's the age difference there. Uh, then the, second, the next night, had a date with her again, and same translator. And uh, after the night, I could tell that I was done with her but uh on the way home she went home first and then sent me and the translator home uh, in a taxi and the translator told me that uh, she was talking about me when i was gone so the translator actually saved my bacon uh, with her and uh, so anyhow i hadn't had anything more to do with her charm date uh, just didn't work out and so now i'm spending all my time with my lady that I met from the Match Guarantee. And uh, I've only got a few more days here in Kev, but after I go back home and uh, spend a couple of months, I'll be coming back and uh, we're going to do some traveling here in Ukraine. And uh, then we'll see where it goes from there.